Class modeling was weird before ES6, but even worse was to model classes with inheritance. Let's adapt this example to exhibit inheritance. I'm creating a multi-choice question model and using the extends keyword to denote that it inherits from the question class. On its constructor function, I want an extra parameter containing possible answers to the question. Let's call it choices. Now, we want our code as dry as possible, so we want to reuse the question constructor if possible. Let's call the questions constructor by calling super. Super calls the function with the same name as the current one on the super class. Now we do what's specific to our class and store away the choices. In our ask function, we call super again and then write out some code to spit out the options. I'm utilizing the ES6 for off syntax to loop through the items. I'm also using an ES6 string template to spit out the number for the option and the option itself. To get the number, I use this good old index of function on the array. I'm also going to remove this answer call for the moment. And we want to construct a multi-choice question class. Lastly, we pass some options to this function in an array. Let's go with yes, no, and... Hmm, not sure. Nice. You can see it reused the functionality it borrowed from the superclass, without any weird code required.